Good morning, students. This is Mrs. Neighbors, your college and career counselor, and today we're going to do a lesson with the Missouri Connections website. This will be the first of many lessons that we do throughout the year, so we want to make sure that you're logging in correctly. So today we're going to set up our passwords and usernames. Your username should be your Novell username, and your password should always be Panthers1. This will help you access the information quickly each time we do a lesson in Missouri Connections. Your TAP teacher has a username for you if you have previously been on Missouri Connections, so check with your TAP teacher now. If you don't have a username, we're going to set those up today, but again, we want you to use your Novell username as your username and Panthers1 with a capital P as your password. Your first item is to go to the website, which is www.missouriconnections.org. Once you're on the website, you will see a login area and you want to use the green login area that says user and you can log in there. Please remember to choose wisely your login and your password. We again recommend that you use your Novell login as your username and that your password be Panthers1 with a capital P. If you choose to change this throughout today's lesson, remember that you'll have to remember that because we're going to be logging into this on a regular basis. So choose wisely what your username and password will be. If your TAP teacher does not have a username for you, then you've never created an account on Missouri Connections. So this is your first time using Mo Connections. When you log in, you need to make your username Melville with a capital M. So capital M E-H-L-V-I-L-L-E -L -L -E should be your username and your password is the number two V-I-E-W-M-O-C, to view M-O-C. Once you put that in, you will be prompted to create a new portfolio. Once you're logged in, you know you've logged in correctly if you see Melville, Melville High School at the top right hand corner. So check there. If you're a previous user, your name will also appear. So it will have your first name listed. If not, and you're a new user, you will need to go to create my portfolio. Please remember, if you do not see Melville High School at the top, you are on the wrong website. It could be that you went to a former school at Melville, like Berkeley or Bernard or Washington, and those schools had you do a Missouri Connections assignment. We don't want you to be on the junior high website, so we need to make sure you're on the Melville website. So stop and log out and create a new user password using the Melville username and to view MOC as your password. Now it's time to update our settings. Once you have gotten into the account, click on account settings. Then as a new user, you should create your portfolio. Click on create my portfolio and then you will see another button that says create my portfolio again. Make sure you do that and then once you're into that setting, everyone should see their name and a place to put your password and username and some setting questions that they can prompt you if you forget your password or username. Take the time now to either verify the information in your account settings or create new account settings for your account. If you've already finished and you're waiting on your classmates to finish their portfolios, take the time to explore the website now. Look at some of the features including the college searches, the career searches, the college comparisons, the financial aid website. Look around it and browse it while you're waiting for everyone else to finish. Now it's time to confirm that your setup is complete. Log out and log back into the website today to make sure everything was saved. Make sure you know how to use your username and password. If you would like to save this website as a favorites on your laptop, that's a good idea because we are going to be using this website quite a bit throughout the year. You can use it from home and go ahead and start working on some of the career searches or you can wait till our next lesson in October. Thanks for your attention. Have a great day.